After Muzan's weird outer shell starts burning away with Tanjiro inside of it, everyone starts celebrating that Muzan has been defeated, but something is wrong. Everyone is completely out of it with the strongest Hashira all passing away as soon as the battle ends, and the Kakushi trying their best to patch Inosuke, Zenitsu, and Sanami up to save their lives. On the ground in the middle of the battlefield where Muzan was, sits Tanjiro who's missing an arm from the battle and has a broken blade, and everyone begins to mourn Tanjiro because he has no pulse and isn't breathing, which causes Giyu to break down and apologize for always needing to be the one to be saved. As Nezuko arrives in her human form, we find out what actually happened here. In Muzan's final moments, he decides to entrust all of his emotions and his will to Tanjiro by giving Tanjiro all of his remaining blood and cells, hoping that Tanjiro, like Nezuko, would be able to conquer the sun, and as Tanjiro's body begins to move, he looks up and begins to completely heal as Tanjiro becomes the new king of demons.